Welcome everyone to your first tutorial and uh, what I'm going to be doing for um, course sites. I'm going to do a series of them for you guys so that you can actually follow what's um, uh, going on and that you can go refer back to it when you need to. This one's going to talk about how to, I'm going to teach you how to sort of upload your content and then link it to the students section. Um, I want to show you that this here is what the students see and this is what we see as the lecturers. Now, we will add it to our content collection and then we'll have to link it to theirs because they can't obviously see the content. So we're going to start, off, I'm, I'm going to work on my DFAT module because I haven't put anything there yet. Um, so it will show you how we can um, create a folder for it and, and so on. Um, sorry, that's email coming through. Right, here you see I've got um, for uh, the actual module, um, I can add stuff for all co course content, courses content if I needed to, but I'm going to just add it to this one. And then we'll see that we have to create a folder. I uh, do, do actually have something, mm, sorry. Um, you can create a folder, let's just do, do that so that I'll show you how it goes. Um, I'm going to say slides too. And I'm going to submit. Now, just to make sure I haven't, I want to see how much, what slides I've, um, I have put in. I've only put in four, so I'm going to carry on giving them more up, more of those. So I'm going to go back to go back. Uh, okay. Hmm. That's a very good question. How do I go about that? <laughs> Let's go back to. Uh, there we go. That that's how it does. I was mouse playing games with me. Um. Let's go back to this. That gives us go to parent folder. Now you'll see we're back to that. And I now want to open this one. Open. And you'll see it says folder is empty. So now I want to start uploading and I want to upload files. The pack packages are those um, for those that have got information or data from the publisher of the book. So then you could actually upload that pack onto, um, onto the course sites for the students to, to see. Now, um, you've got, uh, should have a, either multi, multiple files or single file. Um, some computers seem to only have offer the single file option. I have luckily the multiple one. Um, I don't know what, what the reasoning is behind that, why they've got um, um, just a sing, single file, but hopefully um, you, most of you will have the multiple files. Now I want to browse my computer. And I'm going to go and find my documentation on, on that section. Let's go to documents. And I want to go to Here we go, chapter presentations. Uh, the reason why I have that is because I've already come, I'm going to um, upload uh, chapter 9 because it's already in a PowerPoint format, whereas the rest of mine are in Keynote, which is something that I have, so I'm going to upload that one. Um, sorry, there you can see that, so I'm going to choose that. And I'm going to then say submit. And that takes a while to start uploading. 
um, oh sorry, before we do that, you have to do certain things. I want you to lock your file so that nobody can change your your, your information. And I also recommend enable tracking because um, at each if you can show you that each instance that a, that a user interacts with the item that's recorded. And that's quite nice to be able to see which students or, or what, what students are doing. So um, we're going to submit that now. And that should hopefully upload now into our that section. There we go. It's now going to st do that. I'm going to pause this while we. Oh no, we don't have to. I thought we thought it would take a while, but I was going to pause the recording for this. So now it's all uploaded. Right now, the problem is is that th this is uploaded into the lecturer side and into this section. We now need to go and go into the this section, and we need to go into content. Oh, my mouse is doing it again content and we want to now link that chapter 9 to it so you'll see that I've got things listed here um, so now we would like to build a fi um, file And I want to browse content collection. And I want to add this one. No, sorry, this one. And Sorry, you're not seeing the whole thing here. Right, just move that. Okay, track number of views. Yes, we want to track it. And we're not going to limit anything, so we will submit. No, I didn't like that file. So let's. Um, One, two, slides two. I want to submit. Sorry, you know, check it and then submit it. And there it is. And then I'm going to submit it here. And now it should be available on the student site as well. So that basically, as you can see, it, um, it's, it's for you if you want to have it on your site or um, only. And then you can have it also on um, uh, others. So you'll see that this is now a new file, new file where statistics are, um, are where you basically are tracking. All right. So that ends this um this uh, tutorial i hope this helped if you don't uh, if you don't have a, don't understand something or whatever please feel free to come and contact me or uh, re review the, the the whole tutorial again thank you and i'll see you guys soon